Show me what you got, hey, 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 show me what you got, hey. What's up, YouTube? This your man, Calico The Truth Reviews, back again with another video. I specialize in all things gaming, tech, and vlogs. Um, today, I want to do a special update with you guys regarding my Man Cave 2.0. I just want to give you guys a quick tour. Um, so let's start this video off proper, all right? And also, before we start the video, please like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. And I'd appreciate that very much, all right? Um, so. Starting off with my gaming setup so far in my man cave, I have upgraded a little bit up to my streaming setup. I got a arm here and a mic. I will try to list some of the things that I have in the description down below. Um, I won't go over the pricing of it. I'll just put it all in the description for you guys um, regarding some of the pricing and details of the items that I do have here. Also, I have a Samsung monitor here just for some of my gaming stream up, streaming setup that I have here, um, as well as my reliable gaming laptop as well that I edit videos and I also um, do some of my more uh, heavy graphics and uh, as well as editing software type things that I do just behind the scenes that you guys don't get to see in the background unless you guys follow me on Instagram then you may see some of those things that I do behind the scenes on my laptop with some of the editing software that I do also this desk here also raises raises and lowers um, so I can definitely do some of the things that I want to do as far as like gaming uh, also if you guys got any questions or any concerns about some of the gaming things that I do have here um, just hit me down in the comment section if you guys got any ideas on what I should play next notate that down in the comment section um, alright moving on I also have a pegboard here from Ikea um, just a nice little pegboard that I have a few little things here um, headphones I had some ink pens and um, some markers to notate some of the things that I need to do as far as during the week. I have a camera lens here, microphone, uh, extra battery, some headphones. Also, you guys have already seen the TV here. It is the Sony A80L. The OLED TV is very nice. Um, as you see, it does do the job as far as gaming wise. This game, this game and TV is just amazing. Like I love coming home to this game and just seeing how nice it is how nice it just feels. This TV, the A80L, is just a magnificent TV, especially with the Bravia Core. Um, just check out my previous video. Just check out my last video that I did on the A80L. It definitely breaks down some of the characteristics and some of the things that you have going on for the TV, like the Bravia Core. Um, black levels are just amazing. Like I love playing games. I love watching TV, streaming content, anything you can name, like this TV does it. Um, but just like anything you have, it's definitely got its it's got its up it's got its positives and negatives. But we'll say that for another video. Moving on, I also have some of my favorite gaming consoles here in my man cave slash gaming setup. I have the P5, as you know, and I also have some of the nice little decorative things that I set up around the room, like my nice PlayStation pad alone, as well as a nice air diffuser and I also have an Xbox 
padalone stand here with a nice a word i won't say the word i won't say the name but i will post it on the screen then it this one here also showcases the weather and it also has a clock built in on the actual a a word device that I, i'm not gonna say but um it definitely gives you your notifications nice little details that i would say is a great just just a, just a great a great deal to to have you know um also i have my xbox series x here beautiful uh game console i love i love the xbox but um also some of my design aesthetics around the room i also put up some things from display i also have a luke skywalk skywalker display from display.com and i also have on my left side here a darth vader display from this plate it's actually a very beautiful metal poster i'm not sponsored by any means by any of these companies so um i will put them in the description for you guys just to let you guys know that i am a consumer just like you guys i pay for all of these things with my own money so just letting you guys know that hey i do actually pay pay for these devices and i do have to sacrifice along the way to make you know, make good content for you guys. So please like, comment, share, and subscribe because this is a tour of my man cave. All right, and also I have a nice sofa here that I did buy from American Freight. Um, it is a, it's a two-seater sofa from American Freight. Um, it's a very beautiful sofa. It does have some little knick-knack things on it, especially like, um, <clears throat> some of the inside compartments you can actually store some of your things here you can also put um remote controls uh you can just store your little personal items in there as well as uh it does have some wall ports usb a ports so that you can plug in your devices you can charge your devices from inside of the actual sofa itself. so so it's a very nice little touch i bought this nice sign here from at home um, I just thought it'd be a nice little addition to my gaming setup just to make it look nice. It, it definitely sets the tone in the room and actually gives it a little nice detail, nice little decor. Um, and then the last thing I want to share with you guys is this new ceiling fan that I just got installed. It actually is a little bit more tech side to it as well because, um, let's see here. This ceiling fan, this this ceiling fan is controlled by Alexa. You can also... Okay, so this ceiling fan you can it's controlled by Amazon Voice Assistant, and then you can also change the different lighting tones of this ceiling fan as well as its remote control. So you can change warm, cool, and dark. You can dim out the lamp, the lights as you see. You can dim it out. Um, it just gives the temper the temperature of the room just a nice look and feel, um, and it just definitely just gives you a very good mood upon coming in this room and actually seeing that your lights can be turned to whatever mood you may be in it's a nice little mood lighting type setting so just the lighting in general just presents a just a good atmosphere when you definitely sit down and you want to have a, a a good gaming setup or, or good gaming day when you come in here in this room i just like to come in here and decompress sit down game um and definitely uh i just like to come in here when i get done in my work days come in here and i like to actually decompress and take in some of the nice scents of this air diffuser and definitely game on this very beautiful tv but i have definitely designed this room a little bit now this is just version 2.0 but when next time when i come to you guys when I do a gaming room setup 3.0, I want to be definitely showing you guys a nice showcase of some of my gaming and what I like to do on my day to day. But right now, this is just the beginning. It's not complete yet. So I know guys been telling me, they've been seeing my upgrades. They've been telling me, hey, I, I really want to see this room. Put it, put it up, put it up. Like we, like everybody's been, holla, hey yo, 
Shout out to my man Calvin Campbell. He been hitting me on Instagram a lot right now. He been like, yo, I, I need to see that room ASAP. Like, we need to see that game and set up. Right now, you guys, it's not complete, all right? It's not complete. So give me a minute. It's going to definitely be transformed into something you guys are going to be like just blown away, all right? So give me a minute. It's definitely coming. One more thing that I do have here is a nice gaming sign that I did pick up from Dope Neons. Um, it says Calico's Game Room. So it's nice little aesthetic to the room. Nice little sign. And uh, I think that's pretty much it for the gaming room. Um, Man Cave 2.0, beautiful setup. But you guys let me know in the comment section. You guys let me know what you think about my game room setup, Man Cave 2.0 setup here. Let me know what you guys think because I think that it's a beautiful setup. Thank you guys for coming in to check out my Man Cave slash my game room tour setup 2.0. But if you guys got any questions, Please notate that down there in the comment section for me. Um, and also, holler at me in the comment section if you have any questions. This has been your man, Calico The Truth Reviews. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And remember, take care of yourselves and each other. This has been your man, Calico The Truth Reviews, and I'm out.